Hello YouTubers, in this video I am going to show you how to disable the auto, auto correction and uh, test prediction and according to your preferences uh, you can you know choose what you want on your phone and what you don't want. For example, you are typing in some language other than English or, or maybe even English, the words get typed according to its predictions. So it can get messy at times and you know irritating like I personally feel that I am typing some uh, like I'm ty want, I want to type something else and you know something else gets automatically filled up in the text box so it kind of get, uh, gets irritating at times and also time consuming but yeah also it's also of great help to many people you know it also can be time saving like prediction and all uh, but I personally feel that uh, I, I don't, uh, you know, prefer having this thing in my phone. So while typing, so um, so basically now you have to just like click on settings and then go down. Uh, so can you see this languages and region? Earlier it was in other versions of Android. It was languages and input, and here you could find the option. But now in this update, like. Uh, whatever this update is in realme 2 I'm sorry I'm not aware of that but uh, just go to additional settings and then uh, click on this third option keyboard and input now in the second second block in the middle block like where available keyboards is like written in the title uh, click on Gboard and then click on this fourth option that is text correction inside this you'll get this list like show suggestions tape, next word suggestion and all you can just select and deselect according to your preferences um, suggestion strip suggestion strip what does this do it will give you all, only the list just suggest you it, it won't like directly get the word typed into the typing box like ultimately you will type what you have like the keys only you have pressed on the keyboard but you can get a suggestion close to the word that you have just typed so I think this is okay many a times it say, uh, says you know your time like it can predict your next word and all next word suggestion is also like the same thing so just a second where did this go yeah next word suggestion so suggestion strip while typing the word Third is block offensive words. Now I don't like this thing because obviously we tend to curse on phone like while texting. It happens like that many a times. Show emoji suggestions. This is okay. Um, I don't know. I think it's okay. Like yeah, like you're writing smile, so you get a smiley. You're writing sad, you'll see a frown icon. So I can select like that and then personalized suggestions learn from Google Apps and services and type data improve suggestion yeah personalized suggestion is very needful because like if you're writing in a different language like my language Hindi I'm writing any Hindi word like um, kha liya hai or something like I have eaten so if I try if I've ever typed kha kha so it would Remember that word. So in that suggestion strip that I just mentioned, the so show suggestion strip. So in this uh, list, you will get the word that you have already used. For example, ka, or maybe some any other word, any other language. So that's of quite some help. Then you have got this auto correction. Auto correction space bar and punctuation insert highlighted words automatically. So. I will switch this off. Auto capitalization also I will switch it off. Because we, like you know, even in sentences for a pause or something, we write dot 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 and then continue the same sentence. So I don't want a new sentence to begin every time I use the dot. So auto capitalization I will just switch it off. And double space for full stop. Okay. So this is all. Double space for full stop is good. I don't know many of you know this or not, but if you double tap on the spacebar twice, like, I mean double tap, just double tap, like, quick double tap, so it will insert a full stop.
immediately wherever your cursor is and then uh, where should I go keep this is the notes I guess I don't know I just got this phone today morning and I found it difficult to type so I think I should do it now note G let let me type any random word be it meaningless or meaningful but does not matter let's see whether Google accepts it or not your keyboard you can type it or not see yeah so now see, I, I wrote LIV you can get this do you see this this is the suggestion or like now next word prediction I'll show you H O W how see this R U like see this is the next word suggestion and while typing for example any like uh, D E E C you've got department depressed so these are the suggestions of the word that you're currently typing so I think this good and well to go and thank you if you like the video and if this video was of some help then please like the video and do comment if you want any other suggestion like if I can help you I'll definitely try to help you but yeah that's it thank you and my battery is low so I need to put it on charge okay